Uh, hello, good people. Hopefully you're all having a fantastic day. Uh, went to the gym for about almost three hours today. Uh, no work today, so I uh, spent a lot of time there. Um, working on my side oblique muscles, they're getting, they're prominent. There's still a layer of fat over them I've got to get rid of. Uh, unfortunately, if you go to the gym for three hours, you get hungry and needed to eat some carbs today and uh, just got some bread. I wanted to get oats, but um, <clears throat> had to travel too far. Um, this video is about getting you guys to support what I'm trying to do. Um, number one, I am a certified personal trainer. Uh, unfortunately, the qualification has run out. It has an expiry date. I've got to redo that. Um, I'm here in Pattaya, Thailand, and the idea was that I could uh, be a personal trainer here for people. And at least then it'll be something I would be I would enjoy doing um, compared to other things that I, I don't want to do. Um, but I actually have Crohn's disease. And this is um, rather uh, challenging for people. But I'm just going to tell a, uh, a good story, which is ever since I've started going to the gym, working out two hours a day, six days a week, um, building muscle, eating really good food, staying away from alcohol, tobacco, anything like that. I don't do any of that. Um, but basically eating a lot of chicken, a lot of eggs, um, a lot of rice, uh, staying away from processed food. I almost have no symptoms for Crohn's disease. I can honestly say that uh, one problem is uh, after surgery, I noticed that I still got little inflammation in the intestine. Uh, what happens is, with Crohn's disease, it's like cancer. Then it would attack certain parts of your digestive system. A mine attacked my intestine. I had surgery. I had terminal ileum removed. I had a meter of intestine removed, or just under a meter. I think it's 88 centimeters, um, if my memory serves me correct. But um, I was sick for many years after that. Nothing got right, and nobody really knew what was going on. Um, I had to take um, medication. Uh, I had to take three tablets a day, but I was tired. I felt very unwell all the time. Um, one thing that happens with the disease, you need to go to the toilet. I used to have to go six, seven, eight times a day. Now, because of the diet I'm, I have, and going to the gym, I go once a day, sometimes twice a day. It's scary how I've been able to transform myself. It took me 10 years to work it out, but I'm here now. And unfortunately, while I'm here, number one, I'm an Australian. If I go back to Australia, I cannot afford what I, my diet. I cannot afford to go to the gym. I, it's going to be unaffordable. I will, if I go back to Australia, I will fall down and I'll probably die. Um, I'll get sick again. I know this because unfortunately in Australia, everything is too expensive now. And there won't be any assistance available that would support what I know is working for me. Um, so I'm, I'm, I have to stay here. Unfortunately, I'm, I'm, there's just no work where I am. So what I'd like to do is really get the Patreon going, get the or OnlyFans, many vids. I put, put videos up there. Just, just support uh, that. It would be fantastic. Uh, in the YouTube videos I upload onto YouTube, there's a, there's a PayPal link. Just... 
uh, it would be really helpful. My aim is about US 2000 a month. And uh, if I can continue that, then not only can I go and get the personal trainer, you know, re the, the accreditation, just uh, re-qualify myself so I can get that done, but I can afford the diet. And I can keep affording to go to the gym and everything and just feeling really good and positive about my body, um, which was not the case for a very long time, as I've already said. So um, if you're in a position to help, please do. Um, let your friends know. Um, check the link below. That, that would be great. Um, I'd really appreciate that uh, so I can keep going and keep getting better, uh, keep making more videos, keep building muscle. Even at my advanced age, that would, that's fantastic. And um, keep going with it because without your support, I can't do it. And I know that I can't go back to Australia. I'm in a very difficult situation. So if you're able to help, please do. Um, share this with other people. Share this video with the world. Get it out there. And uh, we'll see if I'm able to continue on this, this journey, I guess. So uh, thank you very much for watching this video. And hope to see you all still clicking on the videos and watching them and uh, staying in contact. Okay, so have a fantastic morning, afternoon, evening, wherever you are in the world, and I'll speak to you later. Bye-bye.